All right, guys, this is part three on the meaning of the first poem in the Bible. Just as a refresher, it reads as follows. So God created mankind in his own image. In the image of God, he created them. Male and female, he created them. So to understand the most likely culprit for what the meaning of this poem is, you have to go back and study the original language that the Bible was written in, which is Hebrew. And when you do that, what you'll find is that the word image in this case is the Hebrew word selim. The word selim simply just means idol statue. Now this is beautiful. You see, God told Moses and all the Israelites not to make idol images or statues of him. That's simply because he already made an idol image or a statue of himself, and it's you and it's all of mankind, the creation that he made to rule over earth with him.